What's going on everybody? Your boy Juan Valdez back with another video and today I'm going to be going over five reasons as to why you should be running Facebook ads. Now to kind of get started, of course, you guys know when it comes to e-commerce or any business overall, you want to have an idea of how the marketing works and you, know, you want to know what are the best ways to drive traffic and get more customers, of course, because at the end of the day, you know, getting more customers, getting more leads and sales is what running a business is all about. Some of you guys may have already heard about Facebook ads. Some of you guys are already crushing Facebook ads. So shout out to you guys. But there's some people that, of course, they're just getting started. So this will be more for, you know, for those of you guys that don't know too much about marketing overall or advertising. Of course, for those of you guys that are brand new to my channel, welcome on over to the V Fam. The V Fam is a family of individuals that are striving to do a lot more than what society has out for us to do. So if you haven't already, of course, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you guys want to see more videos of you know, of course me going over Facebook ads but also all kinds of different ways to drive traffic to your e-commerce business make sure you drop a like on this video and of course any questions you have along the way drop them in the comments below and I'll be responding to you guys so to kind of get started you guys know that the way of advertising and driving traffic and getting new customers has changed a lot over the last few years right obviously the old school method of driving traffic and getting more customers was TV commercials radio magazines newspapers those are the ways of marketing right in the old school world uh, now obviously things have changed a lot with the internet and we have a lot more ways to actually market and get more customers that are a lot more effective right one of those ways being specifically facebook ads you know we've been able to have the pleasure to work with guys like ty lopez and guys like alex mayor these are guys that are spending tons of money on facebook ads and obviously they know a thing or two about what they're doing so we've had the honors to obviously work with guys like that and learn a thing or two when it comes to marketing the first reason as to why you should be running facebook ads is because on facebook there are 1.4 billion people worldwide that are utilizing Facebook, right? So if they have that many members, you know, on their platform, obviously it's a good resource and place to advertise because of course there's so many eyeballs on there. So no matter what kind of product or service you have, your audience is on there almost guaranteed, right? Because there's so many people on there that the opportunity is honestly endless, right? So that's obviously huge. Also, it's a free platform. We can all go on there and obviously use their social platform, but the way that they monetize it is of course, by having people use their platform and advertise on there. That's one of the first reasons as to why you should be running Facebook ads. The second reason, if you had to market the way that we marketed before, which is either with TV commercials, being on the radio or magazines or newspapers, it would be pretty expensive to do so you wouldn't be able to not anybody would be able to just start a business and start testing products and you know start seeing what works and what doesn't because it's very expensive to do that now with facebook they made it super simple where you can actually start testing and you know running ads and marketing for very cheaply right you can literally start you know one of the things that we teach uh, our students to do in our P2P drop shipping accelerator. It's an accelerator we, me and my business partners from here put together, pretty much showing anybody that from start A to Z what they need to do to run a successful e-commerce business. One of the things we teach is how you can market and test products, starting with the $5 budget, right? $5 a day budget. And literally you can start testing products with five dollars right super cheaply and that that's the power of facebook right they have a lot of data where it doesn't take them that much to put your product in front of potential customers right so literally five dollars you can already start to get data and feedback on as to whether you have a good product to test or not you know obviously driving more traffic to that product because literally after you launch an ad you get different metrics back from facebook letting you know like you know how many people are clicking on the product how much engagement it's getting and a whole lot more so obviously from there you can start to tell whether if it's a good product or not or if it's a good ad or not it all depends you're able to do that and advertise and test and get numbers back with very little ad spend right you don't have to go ahead and spend whatever it takes to make it get a tv commercial which is obviously an insane amount of money and you don't even get as much feedback now the next one's going to be on facebook it's crazy because they have so much data that you can literally target almost anything like i mean literally anything it's crazy you can target people based on their behaviors what i mean by behaviors is like things that they do so if someone has uh, a history of buying things online you can literally target people based on that specific behavior that they have that's one you can target people based on interest people that are interested in cat pages 
cat products, cat toys, all those different things, you can target these specific type of people, right? People that have shown to be interested in those uh, specific interests based on liking different pages, liking different pictures, commenting on pictures, and a whole lot more. So that's obviously huge. You can target people based on demographics, based on their age, uh, and a whole lot more. Obviously, that's super important because, again, you wouldn't want to drive traffic for, let's say, um, you know, let's say a baby product to elderly people because, of course, that doesn't make sense. Facebook makes it very easy to make sure that you can narrow down the specific people you're targeting by even age if you wanted to. Also, target by locations, right? You can target a specific part of the world if you think that, you know, they might benefit from your product a whole lot more than, you know, wherever you're living at currently or maybe in other different parts of the world. So that's obviously huge because let's say you're selling clothing, right? Um, specific sweaters or, well, let's say winter-based clothing, right? Obviously, you'd get a much better response if you're able to target you might get a lot better feedback advertising to places like the east coast where it's actually cold than advertising here in the west coast where i am now in california you might not get as good as a response as you would like in the east coast so that's obviously super important i'm sure you guys can see the value in that now that's the third reason as to why you know you should be running facebook ads because you can literally target almost anything the fourth reason why you should be running facebook ads is because it lets you follow up with customers right and that's huge because it's been proven that not every single customer that sees an ad that see that you either pitch if you're doing sales or that sees an ad if they're buying things online usually buys right away right that's not how everybody works some people you know need to study your website do research things like that so of course you know, you're going to have people that will buy right away, but you're going to have people that don't. So being able to remarket to these customers, if your customer comes into your store and doesn't buy whatever products they were looking at, you can then remarket to them either on Facebook or Instagram. And what I mean by remarket is have that ad pop up again on their feed, either on Facebook or Instagram, showing them the product again, reminding them like, hey, you showed interest in this product before maybe now is a good time go ahead and click the link and go get the product right because again when it comes to modern day society you know we're always doing things right we're always on our phones what happens is again people will see your ads they'll click on it they'll show interest to add it to the cart but then you know again life happens right they see a they see something they want to eat they see some good food they see some, some chipotle maybe just like how i do and they pull over grab a bowl i feel you on that and you forget you know, they forget to actually um, check out with the product. Again, it takes some people more than one interaction, more than one time seeing your ad to actually feel comfortable with buying your product. So of course, being able to remarket and you know obviously follow up with these customers more than once is obviously super important because again not everybody buys the first time so that's the fourth reason as to why running facebook ads or you should be trying to run facebook ads because again it lets you follow up with your customers it gives you another chance to make the sale with leads and all potential customers so that's obviously super important who doesn't want it to be easier to find new customers and new leads right obviously we all do that's 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 why we're in business right you know when you're targeting on facebook you can target you know different things like blogs or brands once you find a specific audience let's say they're interested in a specific blog that does really well for you that audience and what i mean by really well is you know obviously that generates you sales and conversions right once you find an audience that does really well for you you can then create a what's called a look-alike audience what a look-alike audience is is a cloned custom audience where facebook will reach new people who are similar to that audience and will most likely be interested in your business right that's kind of what i wrote that was my short and clean cut definition for it uh so it's super simple right once you have a specific audience of people that have had that have already generated you a ton of sales and revenue you can then make a clone of that audience which is going to be called a lookalike audience and it's going to be where facebook pretty much finds all the people that looks just like the people that are in that audience that will most likely be interested in your business and they're going to put your ad in front of them uh those are pretty much the top five main reasons why as to why I believe that anyone running a business should be trying to run ads on Facebook is because it's super powerful. And honestly, we've had great success with it. Again, me and my business partner, you know, we consistently test with Facebook ads all the time, not only for e-commerce, but for any other projects that we work with. So we've had a great success. So I figured why not take the time to kind of share with you guys. I hope all you guys have an excellent day today. If you guys got value from this video, drop a thumbs up on it. Any questions you got along the way, of course, drop it in the comments below and I'll get back to you guys. And of course, if you haven't already, make sure you smash that subscribe button, join the VFAM, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.